day starts with physical exercise which include a basic yoga, jogging and moderate gym. Especially during current pandemic, a moderate breathing exercise is must for all. My working hour is almost 10 hours a day. As we keep doing long hour surgeries, going for hours, especially laparoscopic surgeries, we need to tone our body accordingly. And really, those exercises help me a lot. We have a nice outer gym, which I utilize a lot. And it is in a outer, I mean, clean environment, fresh air, which really boosts up your body and gives an intense energy. Especially that helps me to perform long hour surgeries and my hectic schedule. I pray daily, God keep everyone safe and sound. I should be able to help them when they need me. My hospital work starts with a grand ward round. So I have 18 patients with me and including four in ICU. By grace of God, all are stable and you feel positive and energetic when you see a smiling face on your patient. Especially when they are coming out of their ailments and that makes your day. COVID has changed the whole world scenario. It's a new normal for us now and we never stop during acute crisis. So today's case is regarding a 30 year old gentleman who has a history of GERD gastroesophageal reflux disease. So basically his issue is he is suffering from a different cough and cold and he also feels food is coming in the mouth and irritating the throat. So that's why the AC vent goes in the airway, it leads to I mean recurrent cough and pharyngitis and throat irritation for infection. So he's suffering from last one year. So in this surgery, what I'm going to do, uh, we'll have to mobilize the food pipe from the thorax. I'll go inside the thorax in the chest and mobilize the food pipe. Success of a department depends upon teamwork. I have expert team of anesthetists who always backed me in my advanced surgeries. We have world's most advanced at laparoscopic unit which helps in performing advanced keyhole surgeries. Especially those for gastrointestinal cancers of liver, pancreas, gallbladder, colon and rectum. He is perfectly alright. It was slightly difficult when we went inside the thorax, when the stomach, I told you the stomach got migrated, it was a hiatal hernia, so stomach got migrated inside the thorax and uh, and update you yes. how to go ahead and he did very well, take care, huh? please. Yeah. Yeah. So hi Smriti, how are you? still have the pain in abdomen as you are suffering from gastritis so as i told you you need to maintain your lifestyle so after this any problem if you have further you please meet me and if anything happens further please let me know my organization has 38 departments which includes 24 hours round the clock emergency department and well equipped 40 bed dedicated icu and those are my backbone for treating critical patients That's how my hospital tagline is with you for life.